Hello everyone, thank you very much. I just wanted to say a quick update for the research that I've been doing. I've been in Dominica now for three months conducting research on multi-hazard resilience. I have had such an incredible time going all the way around the island, having lots of discussions with people about what resilience is to them, what has been done in Dominica that has made it resilient, especially looking at the last seven years since Hurricane Maria, and also, importantly, what still needs to be done. A lot of the research that I'm doing is right hand in hand with the climate resilience and recovery plan, the 2020 to 2030 roadmap. And of course, next year, we're halfway through that timeline. So I'm hoping that the research that I am conducting can go right in with that uh, in terms of providing an update as to what has happened in Dominica since Hurricane Maria and what still needs to happen. So I want to say a massive thank you. The, the research that I'm doing could not have been possible if it wasn't for so many incredible Dominicans around the island giving up some of their time to chat with me or to take the survey online. I want to say a huge thank you to MO News. The biggest jump that I ever got in the survey responses has been thanks to MO News uh, for conducting that interview with me and, and advertising the survey. So a huge thank you there. And if you are still interested in this research, the survey is still open. The prize draw hasn't happened yet. It'll be on the 15th of October. So there is still time. If you're interested in this topic of disaster resilience, there's a 15 minute survey online. Uh, you can enter for a draw for one of three $100 cash prizes. The link should be in the chat below, in the, in the comments below. But uh, the link is www tinyurl.com forward slash dom disasters. So you can go over to that website and take the survey. So what's next for me is going back to Cambridge and doing a lot of data analysis. But importantly, I'm hoping to be back here in Dominica March or April of next year to talk about my preliminary findings. The research that I've done has discussed what is resilience, what has been done to make Dominica resilient that can be used as an example for other islands around the world, other small island developing states and other nations. But the next piece, going from that and looking also at the what needs to be done, the next piece is how do we get there? How do we achieve that? And I think that's going to be the main theme of my next visit next year. So again, I want to say a massive thank you to everyone. The research could not have been possible without your support. I'm so lucky. I am so grateful for the time that I've spent here. I've got to be uh, here with my granddad for the last three months, which has been an amazing blessing. So I want to thank everyone uh, and say, looking forward to seeing you next year sometime.